Yo guys, what is going on? Today, I have a super short little tutorial for you guys. I'm gonna show you guys how to fix the black screen that comes up when you're trying to boot up CSGO. Sometimes the startup process fails or just completely glitches out. And if this keeps happening over and over and over, I'm gonna show you guys how to fix it in this video. So let's get right into it. Now, the first thing you're gonna wanna do is open up Steam and go to your library where CSGO is. Once you're in your library, go ahead and find CSGO, right click on it and click properties. This is gonna open up this window and what we wanna focus on here is the set launch options. Go ahead and click this button and it's gonna open up this window right here. Now, for me, I have nothing in here but if you guys have set launch options before, they're gonna already show up. Now, if you don't know what launch options are, they're basically a little commands. You can tell Steam to go ahead and add into the game every single time you boot up CSGO. So for example, you can force a certain frame rate or refresh rate or you can do something to help prevent the black screen like we're about to do here. Now, just a note real fast, I don't have any in my box but if you guys do have anything in yours do not delete it it's probably there for a good reason most of you guys probably have already put something here but if you don't then that's also okay for this video there are two commands you're gonna want to paste here the first command here we're gonna put in is windowed and basically what windowed is gonna do is it's gonna force CSGO to start in windowed mode now I know a lot of people aren't gonna like this especially if you're trying to play stretched res but basically, this is going to eliminate all problems that are happening when your game is trying to boot up in full screen mode. Sometimes booting up in full screen mode can conflict with your monitor or just straight up glitch with some of your graphics settings, causing the monitor to glitch the computer and that just kind of spirals into disaster. But starting in windowed is a lot easier for the computer. You're not going to have some of the glitches you would experience with full screen mode and it's going to just allow the game to actually boot up without a problem, hopefully. This command alone should automatically fix your black screen problem, but if it doesn't, Auto config is the other one that you can set. Auto config is basically going to boot CSGO up to the normal settings, the stock settings, in case you have switched something in game that is causing this problem. Sometimes settings will conflict with each other, and if you switch settings that might do this, this will help reset those and stop those conflicts from happening. Once you have these in game, go ahead and click OK. Now before we close this, there is one more thing we want to take a look at. If you come up here to local files, you're going to see these four buttons pop up. Go ahead and click verify integrity of game files. Now what this is going to do is it's basically going to make sure all your files for CSGO are there and that none of them have corrupted. And sometimes as new updates and patches are released for CSGO and as the game is played over and over and over on your computer for long periods of time, sometimes the files can glitch out and verifying your integrity of game files will help solve this problem if there are any that have glitched. Now, worst case scenario, you may just have to reinstall the game. Sometimes a simple reinstall will fix all the problems, all the stupid problems you are having in game. And I would also recommend trying that if none of these things fix it. But anyway, that's pretty much it. I hope I'm able to help some of you guys out. If this does solve your problem, then make sure you guys drop a like and hit that subscribe button down below. And if you are still having the problem, go ahead and drop your questions and comments down in the comment section below, or hit me up on Discord. My server is linked in the description below. But other than that, hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.